In this video, you will learn how to install sklearn library for a python project in pycharm IDE. And do hit the like button if you find this video useful. So first of all, we will open that python project in pycharm for which we want to install sklearn library. For me, I want to install in this hello world project. So I have opened this particular project in pycharm. Now to install sklearn, first we will click on this file here. Then go to this new project setup. And here we need to click on this settings for new projects. Now here we will click on this python interpreter. And once you click on this, you would see this drop down of python interpreter where all the interpreters are listed that are available in our system. So now from this drop down we will select the correct python interpreter for which we want to install sklearn. And for me the correct python interpreter is this one which is present inside this hello world project. So I will select this particular interpreter here. The selection of interpreter is very important because if you select the incorrect interpreter then you won't be able to use sklearn properly in your python projects and it will give you errors when you will try to import this sklearn module. And as soon as we select the interpreter from this drop down, it will list down all the packages here that are already installed for this selected python interpreter. So for me currently it is showing only pip and setup tools because I have only these two libraries installed in the selected interpreter. Now we will click on this plus icon here which will open up this new window of available packages. And now to install sklearn we will search for scikit-learn in this search box. This is the one so we will select this and click on this install package. So this will install this particular version of scikit-learn which is 1.5.1 which is the latest one. But for some reason if you do not want the latest version and you want to install any older version then you can specify the version by enabling this particular option here. But for now I will go ahead with the latest version only. And once this is installed we will see this type of message here package scikit-learn installed successfully. So now we can close this window from here. And here we will see the scikit-learn and couple of more packages which were not present earlier. So these other libraries got installed automatically because these are the required ones for proper functioning of sklearn. So finally we will click on this ok. And now it's time to verify the installation of sklearn whether this sklearn library is installed properly or not. And for that we will write a couple of lines of python code here. So first we will create an empty python file and for that we will click on this file then click on this new and here we will select this python file and now here we will give the name of the file so let's say it is hello so we will double click on this python file so this will create this hello.py file for us and here in this file first we will import this sklearn module so we will write import then sklearn and also we will print the version of sklearn so we will write print then sklearn dot underscore underscore version underscore underscore now we will run this program and for that we will right click and say run hello so we got the output here and in this output we did not get any error so let me know in comments if this video was useful to you and make sure to hit the like button so we did not get any error here so it means the import was successful and also in the output we have got the version of sklearn which is this 1.5.1 so now the sklearn library is installed properly and you are all set to perform various machine learning tasks using this sklearn library